Hey y'all, I'm so happy that you joined me today and I think you're gonna love this recipe. It's called Fire Roasted Ranch Rotel Dip. And uh, it's super simple to make. You know, we love dips and they're nice to carry to tailgates, church suppers, for your family if you wanna eat outside or inside kind of like a dip before you eat lunch on Sunday while you're getting everything together. But anyway, this is kind of fun, and so I thought I'd share it with y'all. The first thing that you do is take some cream cheese, a block of cream cheese, eight ounces, and you mix it together with your mixer to make it creamy. So I've already done that. So next we're going to add our ingredients, and they are one can of corn, one package of ranch seasoning, the salad seasoning, okay. one container, eight ounce container, no, this is 12 ounces. We need 12 ounces of sour cream, so let me get this thing. And let me make sure that I'm right on the sour cream. <laughs> nope, 16 ounces, I was right, okay. One 16 ounce package of sour cream. be yummy y'all all these good ingredients and you don't have to cook it this that's one thing I kind of liked about this is you know if you're camping or out on a boat for the day or whatever you can make this because it's super simple okay let me get a paper towel or <laughs> dish towel and then one can of Rotel tomatoes now you can use the fire roasted corn that you get in the stores, but it's not easy to find. So this is, what I did was I got the chilies that are fire roasted. So one can of these little green chilies that are diced. I tell you, whenever you open up these cans of things like chilies and all, they're so well packaged that you smell them and it's just the aroma is just amazing. We're gonna add our Rotel tomatoes, the whole can, and don't drain it. Now drain your corn, but don't drain your Rotel tomatoes. We've added our seasoning. Now we're gonna add an eight ounce package of grated cheese. Now I'm using the triple sharp medium and mild cheddar cheese, but choose whichever one you want. So you mix it all together, and look how much it makes, y'all. I mean, this can be a crowd. So honestly, you know what it'd be great for? Thanksgiving, whenever everybody's coming in and, you know, you're visiting and it's going to be, you know, a couple hours before your meal is ready. Have something like this, and people can just enjoy it so much. So I'm going to mix it all together really well. And you can serve this with corn chips or tortilla chips, just whatever you like. Pita chips, we love pita chips. Be really good with pita chips as well. And it's pretty, looky here. It's just a pretty dish. So while I'm stirring it together, let me say to you, thank you so much for following me and subscribing and um, on YouTube, following me on Instagram and Facebook. Please share these videos. I would really appreciate it. Um, and if you just make a little comment, like a little heart, and then share, it does something and makes it go around more. <laughs> I don't really understand it all. But anyway, it does. So please do that. And if you need a Christmas gift, I have my cookbook, Something to Share. If you order it, I'll send you some Christmas wrap with it. My Cajun seasoning, Dana Dash. In fact, I think what we'll do is we will add just a little bit of Dana Dash to our recipe here. What do you think? <laughs> that will give it an extra little kick and be pretty. Actually, you know what? You could put it in a bowl and then put the Dana Dash on top. It'll add a little color. Anyway, I appreciate y'all so much. I love our Miss Dana's Kitchen family. And... Um, I just appreciate every one of you and love you too. <laughs> okay, so here's our dip. Now we're going to put it in the fridge and let it sit for about an hour, and then I'll and let all of the um the, the all of the flavors melt together, 
And so um, then we'll be back, but I'll go over the ingredients one more time. One eight ounce block of cream cheese that you just whip up with a blender and make it creamy. One 16 ounce package or <laughs> package of sour cream. One can of these little diced chilies, a package of ranch seasoning, a can of corn, and an eight ounce package of cheese. Rotel tomatoes. So it's pretty yummy, y'all. You're going to love it. We'll be right back. Okay, y'all. Here's our beautiful Rotel Ranch dip. I think I called it opposite in the video. I'm sorry. But anyway, it doesn't matter. It's yummy and gorgeous. And I think people will love it because it's just a little something different. And it's a great compliment to any big meal or if, you, if you're going to go tailgating, anything like that, this is a dish to make. You don't have to cook it. You just add everything together. So, which you know, because we just did that. So I'm not, I'm not going to use a chip. I'm just going to take a little taste right here. And as you can see, I just added a little green on top and a little bit of our Dana Dash to give it just a little bit of color. It's a beautiful color, but it's white. So anyway, here we go. Mmm. Y'all, it's delicious. It is so good because it's creamy and crunchy with that corn and it's got a little kick. So I hope y'all love it. Bon appetit. <music> 